the poets Ashura in the name of God the gracious the merciful to seen me these are the verses of the clarifying book perhaps you will destroy yourself with grief because they do not become believers if we will we can send down upon them a sign from heaven at which their necks will stay bent in humility no fresh reminder comes to them from the most merciful but they turn their backs at it they have denied the truth but soon will come to them the news of what they ridiculed have they not seen the earth and how many beautiful pears we produce therein surely in this is a sign but most of them are not believers most surely your lord is the almighty the merciful your lord called to moses go to the tyrannical people the people of pharaoh will they not fear he said my lord i fear they will reject me and i become stressed and my tongue is not fluent so send aaron too and they have a charge against me so i fear they will kill me he said no go both of you with our proofs will be with you listening go to pharaoh and say we are the messengers of the lord of the worlds let the children of israel go with us he said did we not raise you among us as a child and you stayed among us for many of your years and you committed that deed you committed and you were ungrateful he said i did it then when i was of those astray and i fled from you when i feared you but my lord gave me wisdom and made me one of the messengers is that the favor you taught me with although you have enslaved the children of israel pharaoh said and what is the lord of the worlds he said the lord of the heavens and the earth and everything between them if you are aware he said to those around him do you not hear he said your lord and the lord of your ancestors of old he said this messenger of yours who is sent to you is crazy he said lord of the east and the west and everything between them if you understand he said if you accept any god other than me i'll make you a prisoner he said what if i bring you something convincing he said bring it if you are being truthful so he cast his staff and it was a serpent plain to see and he pulled his hand and it was white for all to see he said to the dignitaries around him this is a skilled magician he intends to drive you out of your land with his magic so what do you recommend they said delay him and his brother and send recruiters to the cities to bring you every experienced magician so the magicians were gathered for the appointment on a specified day and it was said to the people are you all gathered that we may follow the magicians if they are the winners when the magicians arrived they said to pharaoh is there a reward for us if we are the winners he said yes and you will be among those favored moses said to them present what you intend to present so they threw their robes and their sticks and said by the majesty of pharaoh will be the winners then moses threw his staff and behold it began swallowing their trickery and the magicians fell down prostrating they said we have believed in the lord of the worlds the lord of moses and aaron he said 
Did you believe in him before I have given you permission? He must be your chief who taught you magic. You will soon know. I'll cut your hands and feet on opposite sides and I'll crucify you all. They said, no problem. To our Lord, we will return. We are eager for our Lord to forgive us our sins since we are the first of the believers. 